Hey guys, it's me, Vicstar123, with some more Black Ops 2 weapon camo news. You guys do seem to really appreciate getting updated on this stuff nice and early, and it would appear that there's going to be yet more DLC camos within Black Ops 2, even more, and these ones are a little bit interesting. They're going to be based upon fan votes. So according to a source, a new weapon camo will go on sale for Black Ops 2 based upon fan votes. Actually, it's two weapon camos, and this will be starting on May the 23rd. There'll be an option to vote for two of four camos via the message of the day in Black Ops 2 on the Xbox 360. The two camos that received the most votes will actually go on to sale starting on May the 29th. The four camos will be, as can see, be seen on screen now, Comic Book, Cyborg, Dragon and Paladin. And there's actually a little bit of a description for each of these camos to let you know what they're basically themed on. And each of the camos will come with, as usual, a weapon skin, three uniquely shaped reticules, and an all new calling card. And these reticules will only be available for ACOG, EOTech, Hybrid, and Reflex Optics. So first of all, we have from the distant future comes the Cyborg Personalization Pack, fully loaded with an Electrotech themed weapon skin. Then next up we've got Dragon, inspired by the armoured body of a mythical dragon. The personalisation pack comes with a dragon scale themed weapon skin. Then there's Paladin, which is inspired by the real insignias of the Middle Ages with a medieval themed weapon skin. And last of all, comics inspired by classic comic book designs with a comic themed weapon skin also. So those are the camos, be sure to let me know in the comment section which one you thought looked best. And also for these two camos, as I said before, the voting will start on May the 23rd, end on May the 28th, then the camos should be going up on sale. Actually the two camos in two personalisation packs should be going up on sale starting May the 29th. And yeah, the winning camos will be sold as personalisation packs, which will again cost 160 Microsoft points each, and they'll contain the camo, three reticules, and a new calling card, similar to the current packs they already offer. So there we go, that is what we know about these camos at this point. Personally, my favourites are Cyborg and Comic Book. I think those are the two that are going to get voted in and put into the game. Once the camos do come out, I'll be making a video showcasing them on all of the weapons so you guys can again see them on your favourite ones and decide if you want to get them. Again, with the microtransaction camos, I do want to hear your thoughts on those too because microtransaction DLC seems to be appearing more and more in Black Ops 2 and a lot of people like it, a lot of people don't, a lot of people are impartial, you know, it has its pros and its cons, but I'd love to hear where you guys sit with it. I mean, I think any level of customization that is additional to what there already is, is great. Whether there should be a price on it and what the price on it should be, it doesn't particularly bother me, but I know a lot of people have their own opinions on this kind of stuff. So anyway, that is it for the video. I hope you enjoyed some pretty nice gameplay right there as well, picking up the Brutal Medal right there. Also, if you guys would like to check out some more camo videos, then feel free to follow the links on screen now.